What's good guys, this is Ron's Rides. I'm at Maserati Alp Romeo of Daytona Beach. And normally I'd be up in the front, maybe on the showroom or on the lot. I'm in the details section today. Let me tell you why. This is the 2019 Alfa Romeo Giulia Neto Edizione package, okay? We had two of these come in. Right now, this one was sitting in detail and so was the other one. The other Neto Edizione had yellow brake calipers instead of the red like you see here. Well, that got sold today before it even made it on the lot. They pulled it out of detail, did a test drive, and freaking they, the, the, the person bought it already. I didn't even get a chance to really see it. Um, unwrapped so I'm gonna take this car and put it on camera I'm not taking any chances this could be gone by the end of the night it could be going by tomorrow I'm not sure so I wanted to get this on camera because this is new for 2019 the Neto and is the only package is new so what that is it's the black package for the Alfa Romeo Giulia now this Giulia is a sport so since it's a sport model you already get a couple of different things in the sport package you'll get the black window surround trims you'll also get the nice 19 inch sport wheels when you do get it in the sport package this one like i said being optioned out with red calipers with white script um, instead of the yellow that sold earlier today you also get the rear front fascia that's done up here so you do have a more aggressive front fascia for the sport package so that's something that comes that looks really nice with the sport a biggest thing you'll get with the sport as well is the rear diffuser that looks a lot more aggressive and just to let you know this is a 2019 base model and you can see the rear diffuser compared to the rear diffuser here a lot more aggressive with the rear in the sport package around the exhaust you do have that honeycomb shaped grill now this has a beautiful metallic black paint and you can see it very well in the sunlight here the sparkles and the twinkles there and that's perfect but with this package, it kind of works against it, and it's actually a drawback, and I'll explain to you that in a moment, and I'll see if you guys agree with me. So let's talk about what you get in that black package for the Nero Edizione. Right up front, the grill, done in black. Looks phenomenal. But you will notice that it's not the same metallic flake as it is on the actual paint of the car. So you will see that the grill and the car kind of a little off as far as that paint code. That's gonna be my big drawback when I go to this one thing here because you don't notice it as well here. But let's go up front here because your mirror caps are also done in the same paint but it does not match the actual paint of the car. So you see the sparkle and everything there but then you see the black here and it doesn't match up. It's not the same metallic flake. Looking at it, you can tell just by putting them side to side, this is actually more of a color that matches the wheels, the five hole wheels, than it does the actual metallic paint, which is a bigger drawback just because you have a black car. So the black package on a black car could look a little bit better. It looks good, but I would say my only drawback would be that. Now, this is not the only thing you get done in black. You also get your center caps in the black Alfa Romeo insignia as well. Center caps, all black looks perfect with the red calipers in my opinion awesome I love the package that's not it we're not stopping there check out that badging the Julia badging done in all black how sick does that look makes a big difference when you step away from the vehicle it just disappears it's super stealthy the small changes matter in my opinion here's a big one though the black exhaust tips. How cool does that look with that aggressive rear diffuser? Now I know you guys probably saw the exhaust tips here when I was showing you that the sport package comes with a more aggressive rear diffuser. But now, now that you're really looking at them, what do you guys think of those black exhaust tips? I think it looks so good with the black car. Now if you do want the spec for the metallic volcano black paint, you're looking at an extra $600. If you want the Nero Edizione package, you're looking at 850 US dollars, which comes to a total of 1,450 US dollars for that Volcano Black and for the Nero Edizione package. So I gotta ask you guys, is that worth it for you? I know we're gonna go over this again really quickly so you can see, is this something that maybe you could just get wrapped yourself, 
maybe leave the mirror caps how they are, have it stock, and have it match the actual paint of the car. Get the front grill wrapped, maybe buy some center caps and have those done. And then, like I said, keep the wheels that way. Have the sport package so you already have the black trim. And then you can get the Julia badge wrapped. The exhaust tips are the only problem. That's where you're gonna run into your issue. I'm not sure if you'll be able to get exhaust tips done in black anywhere. So I feel like that's the biggest advantage of this package. Other stuff you can get done, but the exhaust tips just make it for me. And that is one of those things to where, okay, I, I will pay just for the exhaust tips being in black. That's me. It's a gimmick, whatever it is. I still love it. But what do you guys think? I'm going to show you the sticker of the actual car, give you the MSRP. But this thing looks sinister. Um, I was excited to see this. I was excited to get it on camera. That's why I'm back here in the detail department. This thing looks awesome, and I'm so glad that they were able to do a black package. I'm, we I'm ready to see more colors in a black package because this is like the Norissimo Maserati. You can do the Neto Inizione package in any kind of color. So that actually is a, an advantage that it has because you can either do it in black or if you don't want all black as far as your car, you can do the black accents, which might look a lot better doing it that way. So for those who are new to the Julia and don't know much about it, a couple of highlights is it is a two liter, 280 horsepower, turbocharged inline four cylinder engine. You're looking at an eight speed ZF transmission with this car as well. This is a volcano black metallic exterior paint with the Nero interior, which is black. All right, and that's the black leather seats with that. You also have the available options here, or the additional options, which you have the volcano black exterior paint, $600. That sport package I told you about with the bigger wheels, the front and rear fascias done, the black moldings, got the colored calipers, everything there. That's $1,250 US dollars. You're also looking at the driver assistance static package, which you have the front sensors. Okay, you have the blind spot and cross path detection and the auto dimming exterior mirrors with the front and rear park assist sensors. You also have the upgraded 8.8 .8 inch navigation system. All right, and then you have that Neto Edizioni package at $850. And now you're seeing the exterior mirror caps, the grill, the badging, the exhaust tips, and the wheel caps all done in black. And then the upgraded 19 inch dark hole wheels. So your base price, you're looking to start $38,195 for this 2019 Julia. After all the options, you're looking at $44,890 US dollars. And then you have the four year 50,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty that covers that. You do have your miles per gallon over here, 24 city, 33 highway and 27 combined. Now let's go look at the standard options here because there are a lot of them. And I'm gonna slowly go over those. You guys do know Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are now standard for all 2019 models. So that was one of those things that was a bit of an issue for the 2017 models and the early 2018s but now we got everything set up for you guys where 2019 you do get apple carplay and android auto standards so here's my question ladies and gents what do you guys think about the netto edizioni package worth the 850 dollars and if it is what do you guys think about my criticism of it not matching the metallic paint would you do it with the metallic paint and have that package or would you rather have a different color, Julia, and do the Neto Edizioni package with that so it matches up a little bit better? I definitely want to know what you guys think. If you guys want to check out this car, hopefully it's not sold right away like the other ones, definitely check the number down below. I'm going to be trying to get this car out here and shown right away because this is a special one, and now we only have one of them. So check the number if you guys want to give me a call. It goes through the dealership straight to me, and I will get you in this car. I will have you come see it. I will have you drive it. And if you guys want to make a deal on it, come see me. Sorry about all the noise with the detail. I had to do it back here because the car still needs to get clean, but I had to get this car on film for you guys right away. I also have a landing page on my website. So if you guys go in the description below and you click on the website for Maserati Alfa Romeo, it will be strictly for me. You can communicate with me there or you can use the number. This is all for you guys. I wanna make sure that I'm talking to you guys the best way I can and getting these cars out here for you. I wanna thank you guys for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Check the social media links down below. 
I have a Patreon too if you guys ever want to donate to that. Definitely check that out. Every little bit counts. I appreciate you guys. Also, definitely check the Spartan Auto Tech floor mats for the Maseratis. That's something that if you guys are looking for custom floor mats, you need to get those done. With that said, this has been Ron's Rides. I will talk to you guys in the next video. You guys take care. Some good stuff coming. Peace.